Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another favorites video. I didn't do a favorites video for February, so it's kind of going to be my February and March favorites. I already have a list going for April of things that I've been trying like towards the end of the month of March and in the first few couple days of April. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss all of my favorites videos and any other videos I decide to do for YouTube. I have my Instagram and my TikTok where I'm a little bit more active daily linked below and all the products I mentioned will be linked below. We have a guest with us. I don't know if you could see Mr. Parker joining us, but the two of us are squeezed on this little couch right here. Not even a couch, it's a chair. So thanks for being here. Get yourself a little cup of coffee, tea, make a smoothie, your favorite drink, whatever. Cozy up on the couch, in bed, wherever you're watching this, and I hope you enjoy. First things first. If you keep up with me on my social media, you know that I love PJs, like printed, cute, cozy, matching PJs. I have a new favorite. I cannot believe I waited so long to buy these. I want them in every color. These are them. Yeah, there you go. Sleep by Grey Bandit. These are literally like my dream pajamas. They're like oversized and I got them in a size medium. These are the comfiest PJs I own. Like literally the best material. I don't know if you can see it. It's like lightweight but thick. My only, 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 only negative thing I have to say about this is they're really long because I'm 5'2". So short girlies just, just realize that they're long. Oh, I didn't even think to mention. And they have so many different pieces. So I got the pants and the shirt, but I also got the matching shorts for when it gets a little bit warmer out. They make like two different kinds of shorts. They make a tank. So you can like mix and match however you want. They have a pink floral. They have like a blueberry one that I think was sold out when I was buying them. Truly, like literally my dream PJs, like the print, the fit material, the variety of different styles and pieces you could get to match. It, literally a thousand out of ten. If you buy anything from this, let it be these PJs. Okay, next up, another cozy item. I'm actually wearing them now. These are my house slippers. These are from Amazon. Home Top, I think is the brand. I need a house slipper that I physically cannot wear outside. Every time I buy a shoe or a slipper for the house and I say like, this is gonna be my shoe that I only wear inside, I always end up wearing it outside and then it becomes an outside shoe. So these have only been worn inside. They're so comfy. There's like a memory foam padding. I just like slip in and I have broken the backs but I haven't broken the back so you could just slip them on or sometimes if I want to like keep them on on like secure like crocs I put on my what do they call that the sports strap or whatever and I could just like put my foot in there but I like to kind of just put them down I think they have like a ton of reviews on Amazon but they have a bunch of different colors 10 out of 10 recommend they're super affordable really comfy and they're not shoes that can turn into outside shoes so the perfect house slipper all right next up my <laughs> TikTok shop sweaters. You can really do a lot with these sweaters. If you follow me on TikTok, you've already heard me talk about these. And if you're on TikTok period, you see these literally being talked about every other TikTok. It's kind of annoying, but they're worth the hype. I love these. These are just like the perfect sweater to throw on. You feel like super comfy, but you could also like kind of dress it up and make yourself feel a little bit put together. And they're really cheap. I think they're like maybe $12 a piece. So these will be good to wear like in the cooler summer nights or like the cooler spring days. Oh, are you leaving us? Parker's leaving us. All right, we can stretch out. But yeah, they're just so, so comfy. I feel like they're just the perfect sweater to just like grab and go, like that staple in your closet that you know is gonna work with any pant for any occasion. Like they're so good and they come in so many different colors. So would highly recommend. This is one of those things that's like, if I like it, I'll get it in another color. That's these. Sticking in the clothes realm. Again, if you follow me on TikTok or Instagram, you saw me talk about these already. We all know that Abercrombie jeans are it. Specifically, the Curve Love jeans. They just give you a little bit more comfort, a little bit more room. If you have tried Abercrombie jeans and you don't have these in your collection, you should add them. These are the Abercrombie low rise jeans. The style is called the baggy. I have like no torso, but I would say that they're more mid rise instead of low rise. Like they're not low rise. The material right out of the bag was like, it felt worn. It didn't feel stiff. And I hate when jeans are stiff. It already sucks putting jeans on, but when you put jeans on and they're stiff, it's like literally miserable. These, no, like you can sit comfortably in them. You could cross your legs and the wash. 
it's like the perfect color denim it's a little bit darker than it looks on camera i got the short length i'll show you what the bottom is this is what it kind of looks like just like a little distressed bottom i get short and everything i'm five two and it sits like right at my shoe these are it these are going to be the jeans that i wear when it's cold out with boots with sneakers the jeans that i'll probably bring to the beach in the summertime these these are the jeans more clothes to show you these dresses are from target by the brand a new day the fit and style of these dresses is so flattering i don't know what about it like the top like makes you look really like tiny up top it has these cute little like puff sleeves that make it like really girly it's not like too tight it just kind of like hangs perfectly it's the perfect length for like my short or tall girls because it sits at like the perfect spot for me but i feel like even on my tall girls it'd be like the perfect midi dress let me get up and show you them these are two of the prints i have same style they do have another print too they're like really lightweight material they're 35 dollars but last i checked i think they were on sale for like 24 or something like that i feel like this is like a perfect affordable option for a dress especially for this time of year with wedding season right around the corner they'd be perfect for like a spring summer even fall wedding or just any of the events you have coming up like bridal showers baby showers birthday parties a nice dinner literally anything like i just feel like these dresses are perfect i got a size small which is like my true to size so yeah don't sleep on target dresses don't sleep on target ever moving away from clothes I have a little accessory to share. I got these earrings on Amazon. I think the brand that it's a dupe for is called Bottega. I don't know, but I think it's like a really expensive brand. I'm gonna put them in to show you. These earrings, one, they're on Amazon and really affordable. They just like elevate a look. Like, look at that. I'm in a sweatshirt. Like, they just elevate a look so much. You just feel like a little bit fancier. I think they come in silver too if you're not a gold gal. Really, really good Amazon find. Okay, next up, this is the Way Detox Shampoo. I just have a little baby bottle because I got it in a little sampler and I just used it because I ran out of my dandruff shampoo. I've heard people talk about Whey products. I have their body lotion. I have it on right now. It smells incredible. I have dandruff, so I've always used dandruff shampoo, specifically the Selsun Blue like Naturals shampoo, and it's fine. It like gets the job done. I don't experiment with different shampoos and conditioners. Like I find one and I stick with it. I've used that Selsun Blue since probably high school, but I might have a new favorite shampoo. That's a big deal. It smells like smells like a hair salon the smell alone is enough for me to want to use it but i can feel it instantly like I, I feel like it's like tingling on my scalp almost like i really feel like it's truly detoxifying my scalp like getting out all the dandruff and like any product i use or just dirt and oils like i feel like it's truly cleansing my scalp and my hair and even after i get out of the shower i still feel like my scalp still being detoxified it sounds crazy but i swear and a little goes a long way with this i've used this little itty bitty travel size guy probably like four or five times. I'm gonna go buy the full size of this. I'm really excited. Next product, this little guy. I keep all my old makeup, like I think most of us do. Like I have makeup from college. I found this in my makeup drawer. I don't even know where I got this. Maybe in like an Ipsy bag or in like a giveaway that I won. This is the Makeup Forever color pencil, I think, in the shade Wherever Walnut. It's what I have on my lips right now. It is like the most natural pinky nude. It's just, it's perfect. It's your lips, but better. This is my favorite lip liner at the moment and probably to date. And I checked, it's still available, even though it's probably like four years old. They still sell it. This is an honorable mention. The rain is starting to pick up, so I'm sorry if you hear that in the background, but we're gonna finish this video. This is the Merit Perfecting Complexion Stick. I just used this today because I really didn't feel like putting makeup on, but knew that I had to for this video, or else I would edit it and be like, you should have put makeup on. So I just grabbed this because I didn't feel like going in with like the foundation and the beauty blender and all the everything. I was just like, you know what? Let's give this a try. I haven't tried this in so long. Drew a couple stripes on my forehead, my cheeks, blend it out with a brush. I don't know if Merit's brush has a name, but this is it. Again, I only used it today, so I'm kind of cheating calling this a March favorite, but it had to be mentioned. I have never put makeup on so easily, and I remember really liking this. I don't know why I ever stopped using it. Maybe because it's like kind of light. This is in the shade Linen, and maybe I got it like right before the summertime or in the summertime and I got tan, so couldn't use it, but I will probably use this every single day now. Well, every 
every single day that I put makeup on. Okay, and last like product I wanna share is my Target Floral Sheets. Again, if you've been following me on TikTok and Instagram, you've probably seen these. They have been on my bed since I got them. Don't worry, we've washed them, but like I immediately wash them and put them back on because they just make me so happy. I'm gonna show them to you. Hopefully you can see them from here. These are them. Can you see them? These are my floral sheets from Target. As you could tell probably from my room, I am a neutral gal through and through, but those blue floral sheets bring me so much joy. They just feel so like spring and happy and I love getting into bed with those sheets being on. Like they're just the perfect printed sheets and they're tough too. Parker has ripped holes in probably all of our sheets knock on wood, he has not ripped holes in this one. So if you're looking to upgrade your bed a little bit, make your room just a little bit more cozy for spring, would recommend those. All right, and my battery's gonna die, but I did wanna mention a podcast. I've been listening to Real Pod. I don't know where I've been. I love her social media content. She's just so relatable and she just talks about like real life things. I literally feel like I'm in a therapy session or like I just got off the phone call with like one of my best friends and I didn't even have to say anything. Like I'm just listening to it and it still feels therapeutic to me so every single episode even if I feel like when I see the topic like oh I might not be able to relate to this every single episode I take something from so I highly 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 recommend adding it to your podcast rotation I think she posts weekly episodes so would recommend real pod all right you guys well that is it thank you for tuning in to another favorites video i hope you enjoyed it if you did please give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my future monthly favorites videos and any and all of my other videos to come that is it so thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video bye